everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Reaction Therapy. I'm your resident psychotherapist, Tom Stevens, here to break down lyrics to some more Suicide Boys. The music just keeps coming. I love it. Suicide Boys and Shakewell. I went to rehab, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. Maybe the best title of a song that I've ever heard from them. I just love this title of the song. Went to rehab, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. That can happen sometimes in rehab, but maybe that's a good thing. You know our purpose, spread mental health awareness to the world through music and lyrics, and we're going to try to do that today. If you want more Reaction Therapy, go to Patreon or YouTube and subscribe to our new Reaction Therapy podcast channel now out on YouTube. Scrim, Ruby, Shakewell. Let's do this without further ado. Suicide Boys and Shakewell went to rehab, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. This isn't good. Ruby, this is not good. You got coke, was it cocaine on the license? No, cocaine's with the ricin, which this is not good. Like, none of this is good. Got some residue on his license. But how about that beat to start? It throws me off every time. And then there's this reference. I've got to do this again because that blew me away. Come on. Come on. Go, go, go. They put their using together, their activity, the cops, the sirens, give them a migraine. He didn't like those sirens at all. Maybe he's a lightweight. I cannot see Ruby as a lightweight at all. Nope. It's got to be Shakewell, right? Which means Scrim's coming last. Oh my goodness. Just, you can't miss with any of these. These three are incredible. Here it strike lightning when this backhanded, this backhand land down. I can't understand some of this. I don't even know what it means. You've got to tell me what it means unless I can talk to them and they'll tell me themselves. And by the way, when Shakewell's in this with them, does Shakewell write their own lyrics that put in there or do... Grim and Ruby write that and Shakewell does it. This doesn't change your mood. Nothing would, right? Like just listening to this, I haven't even gotten into the lyrics. I thought I saw Brad Pitt in there somewhere, but I gotta go back and see that because just hearing this makes me wanna go work out. Come on, Scrim. Yep. Oh, didn't Brad Pitt do a movie movie called Fury? 
Oh, man. Pull up tweaking off a lot of meth. Scram, not good. Not good to tweak. We don't want tweaking. We don't want meths. All right, do it. Come on. They put so much in so quickly, I can't keep up with it. Nailed to the cross, man. Scrim. I'd rather get high. Like, forget all this rapid stuff. I'd rather just go use. I don't believe that today at all. But man, the way he puts it together. Everybody like I do drag, cancel me please, I'd rather be bad. Fuck all this rapping, I'd rather go stay. I'd rather get high, I'd rather go die. I'd rather just run and not even try. Revenge in my drake, pain in my eyes. Go to the cross, burn me alive. Suicide Boys and Shakewell. Went to rehab and all I got is this lousy t-shirt. I do think I have a connection to this though. They talked a lot about using, they talked a lot about hard living and almost like the experience they had back then that they went through in life that got them to rehab or going through rehab. And it's like, what did this give me? Like what's different about life now today? So interesting to hear their perspective on that. I would love to hear what they have to say about their experience if they've been to rehab and what it did for them and what the title of this song actually means to them. Remember, rehab can be really good. It can be. It can be really bad too, but it can be really good, meaning you take all the stuff you've had in life, you get away from the way you've been living, you start to see a new way of living, and you use that to build strength on for the future because it can be done. But this isn't real therapy. Just Tom, break it down, lyrics to music. If you want professional life, check the link in the description. Go to our Discord server. Leave us comments, feedback, insight. Please educate me on all of this. Let me know what this means, what the title means, what the story means. Everything I want to hear. And remember, if you want more reaction therapy, go to Patreon or YouTube. We have memberships there. And we even have a reaction therapy podcast channel now on YouTube. Subscribe today. Thanks so much for helping us spread mental health awareness to the world. We are grateful for you every single day. We'll see you on the next reaction therapy. Oh, <laughs>